Hi guys, bought this little truck in the charity shop and I'm going to see if the friction motor that's in it will fit in this tractor. I might also see if we can convert this to, well, powered in some way or other, electrically powered. But we'll do that later. First thing we'll do is take it apart. I was looking online to see if I could identify this truck. Underneath it does say... Get that. It says Lucky number 3125. So I put that on Google, searched for it, and the first thing that came up was an eBay listing which was telling me it was a vintage toy. Now I'm not sure if it was genuinely a vintage toy or just the company trying to sell it was telling us it was vintage. It's made in Hong Kong. It's got these nice metal gears in it. And flywheel. And if we look inside this one. Which is a little bit rusty on the screws. Well, they're not exactly the same, but they're similar. Similar size. But this one clips in position with little bendy tabs. And this one screws in position. Mm. I don't even think that's going to come undone because it's rusted. Well, I didn't try much brute force, I just tried to grip the edge of it with a pair of pliers, and I can't do that. So, what happens if we try and just move that flywheel across? Just ease it out. Get it out. Because if this is a genuine antique, this isn't going to help its value, is it? But it did get it out. Try and do the same in reverse to get it in there. Trouble it's all a bit rusty to get hold of anything. That should help though.
There we are. We've now replaced the flywheel. Because the question you've got to ask yourself is which was more valuable, this tractor or that truck? I guess we've proved it's technically possible. So there we go, we've repaired the tractor by swapping the flywheel across.